What's up YouTube? Hack Mods here with a um, another release of a different program this time. This time it's for a custom firmware program that can get all custom firmwares for whatever you would like and the tools we have to do to open it is subscribe. Once you've done that the program will unlock. Thank you for subscribing. Okay, first off, you're on the um, custom firmware flavors. If you want rebug decks, there's all these here. Um, I'll just pick a random one to show you what it does. Click that, and it will go and download it straight from my um, drive. I'll show you how to download it. I won't actually download it because I've already got them, obviously, because it's my drive. But um, to to download them all you need to do is click the download link and follow click save as pick a location don't change the name no point you'll forget what it was otherwise just go save I'll save this one show you okay new bug uh, this is for dex custom firmware this tab anything on here is for dex Anything on this tab is for Rex, which is sex light. Um, I'll show you a few more on each tab as I go through. Okay, same deal. Pick a location, click save. I won't do it though. But um, yeah, just click save if that's what you want. Uh, this one's for sex. Uh, CEX custom firmware uh, and for converting from sex to dex you would use C2D down the bottom then open the E2D uh, root key note this all this program is for custom firmware playstations if you're on a normal uh, sex model retail custom uh, retail playstation this won't be any good to you but this is for jailbreaking playstations Okay, Rebug official site. If you want information, click this link here. This will give you the rundown on um, the whole Rebug situation. If you want Rebug on your custom firmware, go through there, do a bit of reading if you want to. If not, skip it. Don't matter. Don't even pick it if you don't need it know what you're doing with rebug that's fine if not this site here will help you out okay Roger o, if you want Roger o custom firmware pick any one of these I'll just pick a random one to show you these are sex for Roger o. gives you the MD5 so you know it's legit Okay, this is from my drive, so same deal. There's the name of what you're downloading, and um, all you got to do is click the download link at the top, the down arrow. See there, click that. Okay, and it'll just start downloading. Don't worry about the virus scan. I guarantee they're not virus. It's just um. Google Drive can't scan anything over 170 meg but um, yeah just click the download anyway button and there don't rename it again same deal pick a location click save I won't save it because I've got it as I've previously said okay so that's Roger o. anything on Roger o, if you want Roger o, anywhere from 355 up to 460 whatever this is for Cobra Habib if you want Cobra Habib firmware and um, they're anywhere from 355 up to 460. Um, same deal, click the link. We'll get it from my drive. Next, we've got PS3 IDA. If you want IDA custom firmware on your PlayStation, pick it, download it. Same deal. down arrow remember 
it'll start downloading once you click the location click download anyway don't, don't worry about that it just pops up because like I said Google can't scan anything over 170 meg for some stupid reason click save I won't save it because I've got it okay so that's Ida if you want Ferox custom firmware click any of these if you want Steven TJ if you want um, Dex, uh, Team SGK, click them or click Morales Jara, Ultimate, Zero, Arch, same deal, click the link. I've already previously virus scanned everything on this program I've created, so I wouldn't. Don't stress, just download anyway. Click the location, leave the name, click save. I'll skip it. Next. So that's Arch Custom Firmware. If you want Hijmashi, or if um, you're on, you've got a band console and you're on Dex, learn how to unban your MAC address here by clicking this, then this, then this. That will download three programs that you require to unban your Mac address. If you ban on Ghost or Black Ops 2, and if you're on CEX and want your custom firmware unbanned on Mac on BO2 or Ghost, there's a um, thing I've typed out uh, that will tell you the steps on how to unban your CEX custom firmware. And there's a Dex custom firmware unban for Mac addresses video that I've created on my channel. Um, if you're banned and you need to know how, just check this out. Bloody ads. Okay, so that's on boat. You need Bozex if you want to unban your MAC address. So go to the Bozex tab as I am, and follow the video. If you're banned, you you work it out. Um. After that, I'll show you Digital Evo, which is another custom firmware that your PlayStation can have installed instead of the retail model or, or Roger or any of the other ones above in the tabs. If you have any trouble with using my program or any suggestions or um, you like it or whatever, leave a comment in the video. same deal click the download link okay so that's the custom firmware flavors that you can install on your playstation that's all the, all the very best ones okay now we'll go to the custom firmware packages if you want packages these are for converting your console, console from sex to dex some of them some are packages that you need on sex or dex um, if you have any questions like i said leave a comment um, I'll just show you how they work, same deal, click the button, it'll start downloading from my drive. Um, yeah, I'll put a whole bunch of packages in here, pretty much everything you could possibly want for custom firmware. Note that these are the PS3 packages, these go onto your PlayStation. If you don't know how to get them onto your PlayStation, leave a comment. I'll, um, if I get enough comments, I'll do another video on how to get them on your PlayStation. If people are having trouble. Okay, so that's yeah, that's all them. Um, note that there are other packages out there, but I'm a modder and I don't use any of them, so I wouldn't recommend you use any of them because um, they're useless. So just use the ones on my program. I've got all the best ones there installed, ready to get. same deal click the location leave the name and click save okay I've included all the best tools as I just said Uh, 
remember to click the download button at the top or that button there where I just clicked. Same deal, same name, location, and then save. Some links are a little bit slow because they're um, bigger files. So I'll move on now anyway to um, official firmwares. I put a couple of notes in with some program, uh, some of the buttons, so that you can know what they do. Once you've got them downloaded, you'll um, have no trouble. I've been modding for a couple of years now, so um, I only get stuff from trustworthy sites and put it onto my drive, so I wouldn't worry about anything. The PlayStation will be fine, I guarantee it, if you do it correctly, obviously. If you have any problems just like I said leave a comment or email me I'll show my email link later okay now we'll go to official firmware now if you want to downgrade your PlayStation to jailbreak it this is where you go click that click one of the download links um, normally 355 you'd be going for so it's 355 yeah anyway just there it's in there somewhere click it download it from there this is um, test debug consoles. This is not not normal consoles. These are only for um, test debug consoles, which are specific to developers. So if you're not a developer, don't worry about this tab. But if you are, click the custom firmware pirate. I've given you my email detail, uh, my um, login details. Follow the steps at the top in the red there. I skipped a step, oops. Okay, you'll be on the log on screen. Okay, there you go. So now push the custom firmware pirate button that I've created that'll put my details in there for you. You can use my account, don't change the password. I'll hack your system. Sign in. Then go to official debug button. Pick your firmware if you want test debug console firmware. Pick it. Click download. Save, you'll click there, save, don't open because you've seen you won't read it. Oh, your place a uh, PC won't read it. Okay, save it. I'm not going to save it because obviously I've already got them. Uh, now we'll move on to PC programs for real time modding and other, and other features. So if you're on um, custom firmware and you want to say, for example, um, a jailbreak is only you'll need um, dump statistic patcher and you'll need all the other programs that I'll put there on the left tab um, other stuff I put pretty much everything you could possibly think of in need and jailbreak in the PlayStation there's target manager there's um, control console C Cappy for connection to the control console you, these programs will be used for real-time modding so you say you play M.3 and you want god mode you just have that real-time modding on and target manager activated connected to your playstation and then all you need is a mod menu and give yourself god mode or whatever you want unlimited ammo, unlimited bullets, whatever on in online mode so you're playing against your mates with XP lobbies or whatever if you got any questions just, just leave a comment
Okay, same thing, download it. I'm not going to bother. I've showed you enough times now. And this video is getting long enough to cut it down a bit. Now, if you want console IDs, if you've been banned, push the button. This will show, I'll show you quickly how to get the console IDs. They change every day, so there's always new console IDs up there. And if you do use a console ID and it gets banned, it doesn't matter, there'll be more up there the next day. Okay, now all you can do is see where the green working is, click the, the underline beside it. Scroll down. You find the code there it is there. See this one's been banned today on Ghosts and it's been banned on, banned on GTA 5 but it's still PSN active. So just copy the 64-bit the, the, uh, code. Um, now that's for private uh, public console IDs. If you want a uh, private console ID that won't expire for up to three months, um, all you need to do is go to private console ID, click the button, you need membership with this. I didn't give you my membership because um, yeah, it costs money and it's linked to my bank, so I didn't give you that details. But uh, it's not hard to sign your own account up. It's, it's only five bucks or something. But you get limited access, unlimited access to pre uh, premium private console IDs daily. Console Crunch is a great site for that. Uh, this is just a little picture I showed you how to um, how to do it in case you didn't follow my video correctly. Okay, support sites. These are just sources for forums and stuff on PlayStation 3. Modding, tools, games, hacking, everything you can think of you can be found on these sites. Oh, I can be found on all them sites, hack mods. Okay, thanks for watching on Hack Mods. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you need. Or I've put uh, Twitter links there if you want to tweet me, you want to check out my Facebook page, you want to Skype me, or check out my About page, or my Gmail.